DJ Omega here with another video looking at creative ways to mix two songs together without beat matching. I've seen this question a lot on the forums, so I thought I would address it here in a video. This is the first of a couple videos that I'll be doing on this topic. So this video here is going to be looking at finding songs with similar lyrics to mix together. So on this side over here we have Freak Nasty, Da Dip, and I have a cue near the end of the song because this is the song we'll actually be mixing out of. So we'll let you have a listen to that so you know what it sounds like. And everybody should know that song. If you don't, you should. Over on the other side here we have Janet Jackson, Someone to Call My Lover. This is a remix. So I'll let you listen to that so you can hear what that sounds like. And sit back and let me know if you hear any similarities. Janet, I'm so, so, yeah, uh, I put my hand up on your hip. When I dip, you dip, we dip. I put my hand up on your hip. When I dip, you dip, we dip. I put my hand up on your hip. When I dip, you dip, we dip. I put my hand up on your hip. When I dip, we dip. I put my hand up on your hip. All right, I'm sure you hear the similarities there in the lyrics. So what we're going to do is we're going to mix, mix out of Freak Nasty and go into Janet Jackson. Normally I would hit play on the Janet Jackson side, but since I have to hold the camera, I am just going to kick in the crossfader start. So that way, when I start the crossfader over, it will automatically start and stop the song for me. So take a listen here, just another creative way to mix between two songs without beat matching. So away we go. So practice and enjoy. Baby, put me in a box. 